Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. Today we're looking at the Palmetto State Armory Dagger. It's elusive, hard to find. Some people saw my table review, they said it's not hard to find, you just have to know when to look. And perhaps that's true, I didn't know when to look. But anyways, 3.9 inch barrel, it does have forward serrations, it uses Glock mags. Now I picked this up for 300 bucks used and I'm happy to have it. The previous owner gave me a Glock mag, gave me a holster. I feel it was a really good deal. One of the things that they're do, they do with the dagger is they have a steel guide rod and steel sights. Three dot sights, which are upgrades from the Glock 19. Also a flared magwell. Nice grip texturing. I could do without that bump right there. It hits my... Hits my uh, finger right where it rests. But also this cutout here to rip out a mag if you need to. But let's go ahead and take a few shots. First shots here with the dagger, see how it does. I like that. Has a six pound hinged trigger. And I seem to shoot this pretty well right out of the can. Not bad, not bad. I uh, wasn't expecting that. DLC coated barrel, black nitride finish on the slide. They have what they call carry cuts right there. Not exactly sure why that's a big deal, but it does have a rail and or accessory rail, not a pick rail. But I want to show the trigger because I mentioned it's a hinge trigger. Breaks right at six pounds. Their website says five and a half. I'm calling it six pounds, but that felt great. It really did. Those were my first shots. I took one shot prior just to make sure I knew where to hit on the target, but that was pretty much my first shots. A uh, mag worth anyways. But anyways, let me go ahead and load it up and we'll fire it some more. All right, so let's check out the dagger one-handed. When I shoot one-handed, I can't the gun just a little bit. You can't see it so much when I'm like this, but I have a video coming out called The Art of One-Handed Shooting. I worked with Riders Range on that. He's a phenomenal shooter. But let's go ahead and see how the dagger does from this distance. I can't wait to show you that video, by the way. The Art, here we go. And I wish my target was painted. I was doing some shotgun stuff prior to this. And you would see that that's a pretty decent grouping with the shots that I've taken with the dagger so far. The magazine release is fairly stiff. It is like really stiff. To drop that is stiff. I'm hoping that loosens up over time. But I didn't tell you one of the most important factors with the dagger. MSRP uh, 299 300 bucks if you can find one and it's a, a, a great deal okay you get a mag pull mag so glock mags will be purchased separately or if you already have them like i do it has three dot sights the previous owner black black those out people say well that's nothing more than a glock copy well people say that about everything honestly glock has like 550 to 600 dollars is what they ask for the G19. This so far is pretty impressive. The trigger guard has a unique look to it. it does have a ledge right there, a little undercut in the trigger guard right there for a higher grip. I'd like to see a little easier to work magazine release, but I do like the forward serrations and the trigger right at six pounds feels pretty good. How about a limp wrist test? <laughs> Forget you, man! <laughs> I hate you! <laughs> 300 bucks for this? 
It's a Glock copy. <laughs> I'll get you, you Glock fanboy. <laughs> Wow, the dagger continues to impress at the range. Honestly, I wasn't expecting it. I wasn't sure what to expect. A lot of wind coming in, cold day, 12 degrees out here. I kind of like it, you know, just kind of private in a huge space, but the dagger is impressive. You know, it's getting it done. I'm gonna shave that down. I don't like that. Magazine release tight, but the shooting impressions really good so pretty happy with the dagger i like the price 300 bucks i like the steel guide rod steel sights forward serrations trigger hinge trigger not bad i i give it a thumbs up and i hope you give the video a thumbs up let me close out the right way if you like videos like this please subscribe and share i always appreciate thumbs up button thanks for watching and you guys be safe